hello down there. I'm Dana. And you are... Mr. Spy. You and I... We're gonna play a game. You're gonna tell me what the Norks know about us. And I'm gonna hurt you while you do it. This game will be a lot more fun for me than you, I'm afraid. The question is... Will it be quick? Or will it be... Really? Really? Slow. Just scream as loud as you want, okay? No need to suffer in silence. Okay. Nipples first. <laughs> hey, Dana. I hear we got company. Who is he? Ah, uh, just another spy. I'm gonna ask him a few questions. How do you know he's a spy? Well, that's what Baker and Skizari said. Those two? Dana, they're dumb as shit. Do you got anything on him? Say, pal. Get some ID. You got here. Ethan Brady. I knew it. Walker's message said he was coming in with this guy. Well, no one told me. Yeah, well, if I could ever find you when I need you. Mm. You'd only just joined Harvey's crew, right? I'm sorry about what happened, but you survived. We could use a guy like you. I'm Jack Parrish, by the way. This is Doc Sam Burnett, and, uh... Ain't no more you met. No hard feelings, I hope. You're a lucky boy. You okay, kid? Looks like some head trauma. Possible concussion. I got some pills you should take. Hey, Doc, you don't need to open up. He needs to keep his focus. Head injuries can be unpredictable. You feeling confused, kid? Disconnected? He's fine, Doc. You know what's real, don't you, Brady? Looks like he's been through a lot. Last thing he needs is more trouble. Can't you fix him up a new ID and let him go? It's not that easy, Doc. You saw the screens. The Norks want this guy bad. Besides, we need people like him. Ain't afraid to take a chance. And he's seen too much already. Yeah. So, what do you say, Brady? You gonna stick with us, huh? It ain't gonna be glamorous. And you're probably gonna die. Ah! Speeches like that! I'm amazed we haven't won the war already. Yeah, well, that's why we need Walker. Our words ain't my specialty. So, any objections to Brady joining us? Yeah. No? Sweet. Well, if no one's gonna listen to me, I'll be getting back to my work. Good luck, kid. Go along, Doc. All right. As soon as we get word where they're holding Walker, we gotta find a way to bust them out. Everything depends on him. But first things first, we're gonna get you trained up and show you how we do things around here. I'm heading out. Got that transceiver to take care of. See ya. Walker. Well, it's good you came along when you did, Brady. Walker must have seen potential in you. I don't know if he trusted you. My instincts tell me you're all right. We need more people. People willing to join the uprising. Now, that's what it's all about now. You gotta stir the people up, and soon enough we'll be snowballing. Get the whole city behind us, and the Norks won't stand a chance. Walker's a spark. People will follow him. We gotta get him back. Uh, we've been down here for a few months now. This is all part of the Broad Street subway extension. It was mothballed back in 21 when the city ran out of money. It's not on any of the pre-war maps, so the Norks don't know about it. Here you have it, Brady. This is the boot that's gonna kick the KPA's ass. Come on over here. But well, first things first, let's get some American steel in your hands. This is, uh, Sidney Cook. He runs the armory. Who's this? That's Ethan Brady. He was helping Walker. Walker got arrested? Yeah, but that wasn't Brady's fault. Don't worry about Cookie here. He's, uh, generally in a pissed-off mood. But he's a genius in improvising weapons, and that's why we keep him around. Ain't that right, Cookie? Always cooking up something new. <laughs> One day you're gonna make that joke and I'll shoot you dead. Then we'll see who's laughing, huh? Sidney, take it easy, will you? Brady needs a weapon. What can you spare? You can... Have... This. Turns out you're... 